74-year-old Ralph Jordan is a successful entrepreneur, a father, and now a prostate cancer survivor. A strong family history of the disease prompted Ralph to get tested yearly. And my PSA was like 2, 2.5. Uh, this time it was a 4. Ralph was lucky. Doctors caught the cancer early, but it doesn't mean the PSA test is foolproof. The problem with PSA is that other things can also elevate the PSA, which are non-cancerous, and sometimes you can have cancer without an elevation in PSA. Researchers at Sanford Burnham Medical Research Institute in Orlando are working to more accurately diagnose prostate cancer, starting with a set of RNA molecules believed to regulate cell development. We were able to identify some of these RNAs being secreted in the urine of the prostate cancer patients. The team examined the urine and tissue samples of prostate cancer patients with those who did not have cancer and found the RNA levels were higher in those with cancer. Researchers say the RNAs are easily detected in urine. Our hope is that we can develop a urine test that would be a better biomarker for diagnosing prostate cancer. New screening that could be faster, more accurate, and end up saving even more lives. I'm Marty Salt reporting.